Hi guys, so are you ready to draw with me today? So today we will be drawing a skateboard. So let's get started. And if you are new to my channel and haven't been here already, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to get a video every single day. So I release a video for you every single day. So if you have any requests for me to draw for next time, please let me know by commenting below or if you want to connect with me through Facebook or Instagram, you can uh, check out my description box below for those links. So I'm going to start off with the top part and then go to the bottom and also I'm going to draw the back side of the skateboard because the front side, the top side has that black um, grip. Um, for skateboarders so I decided to draw the back side so I can add color to it so to give you some fun facts about skateboards today I'm gonna choose the website myproscooter.com <laughs> So according to that, um, they have started skateboarding as a sidewalk surfing. So before skateboarding took off as a major success, it was seen here and there around local neighborhoods. Most people were creating these skateboards and calling them sidewalk surfers. Uh, in a sense, the idea was to recreate the charm of surfing on land. Um, and some kids would surf downhill um, in the neighborhood and uh, that with the help of the skateboard it says so a lot of people assume it's the wheel or build quality that determines how fast you're able to go however studies have shown it's the bearings that have a big role to play if you set the bearing higher it is going to lead to a faster skateboard compared to the traditional options. So there you go. I'm not a big skateboarder, so I don't know a lot of information. If you are, I'm sure you already know all this. So if you are interested in skateboards and if you are liking this video, please let me know in the comments below. And you probably have uh, a nice skateboard as well. So um, let me know how you like this. So you can see now um, I already added the two wheels like the front and the back wheels so I'm just gonna add that little chrome detail to the back and finish it off and I'll go into coloring I'm gonna make it really colorful so that uh, it looks cool so um, I'll show you how I colored it as well shortly and to give you some more fun facts originally shaped like a rectangle it says it is originally shape uh, it its original shape wasn't as rounded as it is nowadays. Uh, in fact, it was simply a plank of wood, 2x4, that had wheels attached to it. Over time, designers started to understand the theory behind speed, balance, and durability, making it easier to create aerodynamic products. However, this came after a long period where skateboards remained simple planks of wood. And um, in the beginning, people went out of their way to go shoeless on a skateboard. And the initial purpose was to recreate surfing on land. So that's why they went shoeless. Um, but this meant people would grab their board, take off their shoes, socks, and head out for a quick ride. So probably a lot of kids were shoeless those days. Mm -hmm. 
so you can see now we're done with the drawing part so I'm just gonna um, uh, do can do um, in a nicer way on this skateboard and I'm gonna start coloring I'm just gonna add stripes of color to make it bright um, and then I'll show you how the full color drawing looks like as well so you can get the full idea of how I colored it if you're liking the way I'm coloring it but really it's up to you skateboards come in so many different um, colors and so many different patterns graffiti uh, they are really colorful and beautiful so uh, if you're drawing this and if you want to add some designs um, you, you can add whichever design whichever color that you really want and make it as beautiful as you want as well so I will add a lot of bright colors to this wheels will be just black um, and I'm just gonna add a little touch of green to it as well like a darker green and then I'm gonna add a lot of color So to give you some more fun facts, most people are going to hear the term goofy when it comes to the skateboarding stance. This is when you put your right foot forward instead of your left foot. The reason it was named after goofy had to do with how he would use a, a skateboard in the show. So um, now uh, you can see the theme that I'm going for, just stripes of different colors. So I will show you how the full color drawing looks like so um, you get the idea. Um, so this is the full color drawing of the skateboard. So I hope you like it and if you do, don't forget to hit that like button and leave a comment for me. And if you would like to buy products with this on, check out my Redbubble shop link for products. I have so many for you to choose from. Uh, caps, t-shirts, books, backpacks, and even bedding material and um, shower curtains and blankets and all sorts of stuff. So check it out. And now I will put some next videos for you to check out next. And don't forget to hit on my face logo to subscribe to my channel. I bring a video every single day to you. So I hope you have a great day today. And as always, I will see you tomorrow. And if you have any requests, let me know in the comments below as well. So hope you have a great day. Bye.